Hi friends, this is Miss Jordan, and today I want to show you an awesome way of how to do a form of printmaking. We have done printmaking in the past, but this is by far one of my favorite techniques of printmaking, and it is really simple and easy as well. We are going to be using shaving cream for this printmaking technique. And here are some of the results. These are some that I did, and I would love to see how yours turn out. Just check out all the variation. It's going to be like an abstract marble look, but they turn out fantastic. To start off our printmaking activity, we are going to need a paper plate, some food coloring, some shaving cream, and then later I am also going to use a cut piece of cardboard or thick cardstock and a toothpick. Save these for later. For now, I am going to spray some shaving cream on my plate, just like so. Have a nice flat layer of shaving cream. Make sure you ask your parents if it's okay to use a shaving cream before you just take it. So now I'm going to take food coloring and I'm just going to pour a few little dots here and there for color. Once I have that, I am now going to pull out my toothpick and I am going to swirl these colors around. Just like that. It's going to look very abstract. Once I have that, I am then going to take my piece of paper, I cut a square piece of paper that's going to fit really nicely onto my shaving cream. So I'm going to take that and I'm going to place the paper really, really gently on my shaving cream and I'm just going to press down with my little finger and rub it around. Now once I have that, I'm going to pull it up, and I am now done with this, so I'm going to put it off to the side and check out my print. This is where you are going to need that piece of cardboard or cardstock. I cut mine out of a plate. Whatever you can get your hands on, cardboard will work, plastic will work. Now I'm going to take this and I'm going to gently get some of that shaving cream off. And I'll wipe it off on my plate that I just had and I am going to scrape off the rest. Just like that. You want to make sure you get all of the shaving cream off just so it doesn't make your paper really, really wet. And look at that. Look at that print. These are super easy to make and the colors really turn out great. Once you're finished with your print, take this plate that you just discarded and you can also continue to use it. You can add a few more drops of your food coloring and make your design. And you can still reuse this shaving cream. So I'm going to add a fresh new piece of paper and I'm going to do my second design. So you can reuse this shaving cream until it turns all one nasty color. But you can still continue to make prints with it.
Look at how cool. There you go. Hope you guys have fun with this.